To give just to need is a very low level, carnal, soulish thing. Only one time in all of God's word does he say these words. And my God shall supply all your need according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Paul never said that to any other church. He says, no church partnered with me in giving and receiving except you guys. And he says, now, because of that, my God will supply your needs. Because of the people's willingness to bless Paul in his ministry, Paul challenges the church. Now, some people, it's very, very hard on them mentally, and I understand that. I mean, listen, the Lord is, has provoked us again and again. And there's times where we provoke ourselves. We've gone to a lot of churches, and sometimes a pastor will say, give what the Lord tells you. Well, sometimes the Lord doesn't tell you anything. The woman with the alabaster box, the Bible never says God told her to give that. She stirred up her heart, and she just gave, not out of need, but she gave out of love. The Lord didn't need her to break open a $70,000 perfume box. So it was a $70,000 gift broken, smashed it, and poured it all on Jesus. So there are different kinds of giving. A higher level of giving beyond the tithe, we can give towards need. Then beyond that, there's a higher plane where we give out of love. Paul says, listen, I didn't need, I didn't have a need. You didn't give to my need. But he said, you gave something that was a sweet smelling sacrifice, just like the woman who broke the alabaster box. So we can give just because we love. So sometimes I'll give, I'll just tell my wife, I know better than to ask my wife because she's going to double it. Here's what we're going to give. And she's like, no, let's double it. Sometimes we give not out of need. Sometimes we give out of leading. But then there's also that time where we give beyond that, where we just give just because we love the Lord. Amen.